Hello guys, in this video, let's discuss set header policy for request and response. So guys, if you see this diagram, we have consumers and then we have backend APIs. So again, consumers, they want to consume our API. And so in between, we have this Azure API management. So basically, when this consumer calls our API, the request, it first reaches to our API gateway and then this API gateway calls the backend API and then it accepts the response from our backend API and then it returns the response to the caller. Great. So guys, when the request is reaching this API gateway, this request, it will contain headers. And when the response is returned from this API gateway to the caller, even that response, it also contains headers. So sometimes we may need to delete some headers information or we may need to update some headers information. So for example, in case of response as well, we may need to delete some headers information or we may need to update some headers information. So for example, we have a scenario where users personal information, let's say telephone that is returned in the header of response or the response header, it may contain session ID or the response header, it may contain token. So all this is sensitive information and we need to hide it, right? Now one solution for this is we may implement code changes in the API. But obviously we don't want that, right? And for that we can use this set header policy. So we can apply set header policy on request and response both. But in this demo, we will be working with set header for response. Okay. And finally set header, it means we can delete a field from header or we can update a field or we can add a new field as well. Now guys, we are in Azure portal and this is our API. So we are under APIs and if you see, we have one API that is tourist places API and it has one operation that is get tourist places. Okay. So let's test this operation. And here I will say send. Let's go down. So guys, our API call has been successful and it has returned the popular tourist places as well. Great. But guys, observe this, the header, it contains telephone number. So it is user's personal identification number. And obviously that should not be present. So what we can do is we can apply set header policy on the response. And now let's do it. So for this, let's go to this design. So obviously we are applying the policy on response. So it will be outbound processing. So let's go down and here, let's say add policy. Let's say set header. And obviously here we need to provide the name for that field. So I will say telephone number and the action that is what action we want to perform. So we want to delete this field from the header. So let's say delete and here I will say save. So that's it guys. Let's close it. And now let's test this operation again. And now I will say save. Now let's go down. So again, we have got 200. Okay. But guys observe now that sensitive information is now missing from this header. So that's it guys. Thanks. Thanks for listening.